If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. If a customer overpays an invoice or statement, or gives you a down payment or prepayment, you create a credit for that customer when you enter the payment into the Receive Payments window. Later on, if the customer requests that you send the amount back or cancels the order, you can issue a refund check on the credit for the payment that you accepted. To create a refund check, just select Banking, Write Checks from the menu bar to open the Write Checks window. At the very top of the window, use the Bank Account drop-down to select the account against which the funds will be withdrawn. Enter the date of the check into the Date field. Use the Pay to the Order of drop-down to select the name of the customer or customer job to whom you are issuing the refund. If you will be printing this check, then check the Print Later checkbox in the main tab of the ribbon at the top of the window. Enter the amount of the credit refund into the Dollars field. Then set the account in the Expenses tab to Accounts Receivable. Save and print the check and give it to the customer. After that, you must return to the Receive Payments window to match the credit to the refund check that you just wrote to the customer or customer job. To do this, open the Receive Payments window and select the name of the customer or customer job from the Received From drop-down. In the listing at the bottom of the window, you should see the refund check that you just wrote appear. Select the check in the list, but do not mark it with the check mark by clicking into the check mark column to the left of the check. You can click into any of the other columns to simply select and highlight the line item. Then click the Discounts and Credits button that appears in the main tab of the ribbon at the top of the window. If the Discounts and Credits window then appears, select the Credits tab in the Discount and Credits window. If the Apply Credits window opens instead, then the credit should appear on the Credit tab in this window. In either window, if needed, you can click into the leftmost checkmark column next to the credit that matches the refund check amount to select it. Then click the Done button to apply the credit to the check. You can then click the Save and Close button to finish the transaction. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www dot teach you comp dot com